Oi boys, welcome back, welcome back to some Rugby League Life 2 career mode with the worst team in the league. Back with Parramatta of course. Today there's a shift to the lineup, we've got Jared Hain going from fullback to centers. And Roger Tuivasa Shek will be going to fullback, can seal out to the wing. We're gonna keep it short and sweet, just in case we get a nice monologue from Gus. I'm Let's sure tune the in. Coach has a game plan to upset the favorites, but his players are going to have to be very disciplined with the football if they want to have any chance of winning this match. I'm afraid they are simply going to be outclassed here. I think disciplined football is the key point there, Gus. They've uh, been a little untidy in recent matches. And it is time to get this one underway. Honestly, I wouldn't mind it. I wouldn't mind just keeping Hayne in the centers. That's Tuivasa Shek. That's a much better return. I think we'll definitely be better off not touching the right analog stick at all when we're running. In open space, I mean, because we always step when we don't want to. As we shift it down the line, that's a great ball. The two on one. Willie Tonga finds. But Raja, who gets away from Croker. That was clean. That was clean. That might be the cleanest one we've scored so far for like a set play, if you will. We did learn something from it too. I did have to straighten Tuivasa Shek's line. As we nail our first conversion. If we score nice tries, we'll definitely throw in our own replays since there's no replay system. Anyway, Croker gets us back on the way. Tuivasa Shek. Sends it off to Ryan. Love the bumps. What a shot. More that. What a tackle. Two hands away. As Benji gets tackled. Man, it's only been 12 minutes. I forget these are 10 minute halves. It's like no in between in this game. I don't know why he did that. I tried to press Y to pass, but man's ended up taunting. Beautiful. And the offload, Jared Hain. Oh, kill him. Ooh, give me that. Give me those ankles. Little dummy to the right, little dummy to the left. Might like he be a bit of a cheat code having the slat out wide. Again, that'll definitely deserve like a little replay. That was a pretty big shift. As we bring this one back. Too much. A hiding could be on the cards. The way these uh these plays are going at the moment. As Benji tries to step off his own, I will make it my mission to pull off. Oh, penalty! A 360, boys. A 360. It'll have to be Benji. As RTS takes it to the line. Some interesting running lines here. Ryan takes it again through the middle. A little settler. As we shift it to Mana, we have the numbers. Mana, the bump. The pass to Rennie Matur. And he's over for that. Let's take a look. He definitely gets there. Damn, we missed another. That should have been an easy kick. That's not too bad. They tap right on the halfway line. That's very fair getting us underway. That's the green machine. Come down the short side. All right. I respect it. Nice bit of play. Bit of urgency. Some quick passes. We have no one on our left. That's where they go. Berrigan finds an offload. I was hanging back, didn't know whether to join or not. And they still they still got the pass away. Croaks from out wide. That one, straight down the middle. Now it's getting interesting. Inside the 30. That'll find touch. Scrum's not as easy to score off like in League Life 4. I say that, but I have been trying to go for these same old drawing passes off the scrums. Haven't been popping off for us. Oh no. Benji. Go straight to McCrone for the interception. Typically one every game, there'll be a match where we play super conservative. Our 
Jadra had to come in. Yeah, they do find the pass too. I love that they actually offload it. They give you different looks. And there's more sense of urgency. <sighs> Tough. After all those years doing that to the AI on League Life 4, it happens to us. No try in the second half for us. Looks like it'll stay that way. Can we keep them out? As they try and step their way through. Come off it. Tom Leroy Lars. Last play of the game. Gotta keep him out. They shifted and tilts. Doesn't find a pass. It was getting a little dicey there at the end, but the Raiders. They came back and turned it into a classic grinder. Holding us scoreless in the second half. Did not expect it to be this close, like I was saying earlier. I thought we were en route to a hiding, but the Buddy Raiders. Not too often do we go pointless in a half of footy on League Life 2. Like we could easily cheese our way to some points. Don't get me wrong. There will be no cheese in this though. You know, getting those cheap resets off the grubber kicks and all that. Spamming passes and whatnot. We're here for the aesthetically pleasing plays. And there was absolutely nothing in that second half. But yeah, we're going to wrap it up there. We're going to go for one game today for your Sunday morning. I'm about to get some games in on League Life 4 and our Dragons and Wolves career modes. So expect that. As always, if you did enjoy that, so be sure to run and straight that like button. And for more rugby league related content or more content in general, go ahead and drop your boy a cheeky sub. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll see you. Later.